Thank you for joining me today. We're going to be going over 507 errors. A lot of people will find 507 errors come up when they're trying to print a form in their system. The reason for the error is the computer, or in this case Sage Business Vision, is informing you it cannot locate your form or the form name is invalid. How can that happen? If you have a custom form and in our setups you were not pointing to the correct form, it could give you an error that way because it doesn't find it. If you had problems with your computer and it had to be remapped, all of a sudden you're not on the proper mapping to find the form so you would get these type of errors. Another situation is for each user the printers are set up and the printer forms are set up per user. So if you're working on your desk and then you have to go to a different computer and it's mapped differently, you'll start to get 507 errors because it will have your setup, not the other computer's setup. Okay, so let's actually go and see a 507. What I'm doing is I'm coming into Sales Analysis and I'm going to call up a, a previous done invoice and I'm going to reprint it. So once this invoice comes up and we print it, boom, we get the 507. To solve this, what we need to do is we need to come out of this area, so you're back on the main screen, come under File. Once you're in File, come to Printer Setup, Printer Properties. Because I'm dealing with invoices, I'm going to come under the invoice area into the main form. The form name is where it's looking for my actual report or my invoice in this case. So this path is incorrect. It does not find my invoice plain paper from this area. So what I need to do is I need to click on the browse, then it immediately brings me into a reporting area. Please use the look in to make sure you're pointing to the right area. So we're going to go to business vision into reports. And at this point, if you click in here and you start typing your name of your form, it will jump to it. In my case, it's one letter sensitive so that I can use my scroll bar to bring it over and I find my invoice plain paper report that I want. Double click on it and save your change. Once it's saved you can come out and then we can try it again. So we're coming back into sales analysis. Double clicking so we open it up. Once it's open and let's try to print. There we go. Our 507 is now solved. So basically a 507 is that it cannot locate where your form is. As soon as that happens, you got to go under File, Printer Setup, and make sure you have it reporting in the proper area. As soon as you do that, your 507 will be fixed. Okay, thank you, and I hope you have a great day.